What's up guys, Brad here with Shiny Tech Things, where we tech things seriously. And on today's Tech Support Tuesday, I'm going to go ahead and show you the Macintosh equivalent of WGET. So if you go ahead and open up a terminal here, and you can do that by holding down the command key and pressing spacebar, and then starting to type in the word terminal. Now if, for example, we went ahead and tried to do like WGET, over to say like google.com, And because it's wanting a particular file name, we'll just use, say, index.html. We will get this command that wget is not found. So let's go ahead and clear the screen. And I'm going to go ahead and show you that there is nothing in this folder right now. Now we're going to go ahead and just use the curl command. But we're going to do curl hyphen uppercase O and then put in the full URL. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit return. Now if I go ahead and take a look, you can see here that index.html was downloaded. Now we can go ahead and say cat that. And you can see the response from that file. Now, if it did exist, then it would actually have downloaded that particular file. Uh, here, it is just a uh, HTTP 301 a response saying that it was moved. But uh, that is basically how you go ahead and do the equivalent of wget on a Mac. Thank you for watching, and if you haven't already, go ahead and slap that like button, and also consider subscribing and turning on notifications. I do my best to go ahead and release new videos on Tuesdays for Tech Support Tuesdays, and my regular videos on Fridays. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Mm -hmm.